Hello and welcome back to Tech Day's 10 Minute IT Jams. I'm Tech Day's Managing Editor and today we're speaking with PagerDuty's Solutions Consulting Manager, Avija Pandiel. PagerDuty was born from the idea that software development and operations could work together and collaborate with strategic benefits for every company. These companies leverage PagerDuty for a range of technical functions, so let's find out more about the platform. Welcome Avija. Thank you for having me. All right, so for an IT manager that hasn't worked with you before, who is PagerDuty and what is your key offering? So PagerDuty is a leader in digital operations management platform of management. Uh, 13,000 organizations in 80 different countries use PagerDuty to detect, triage, resolve, and prevent incidents before they impact their end customers. Our SaaS platform supports 500,000 users globally uh, who build, ship, and run services to deliver resiliency to their customers. Uh, through use of machine learning, uh, 360 plus out of the box integrations uh, and automation, we bring together the right people with the right information in real time so that they can address unplanned issues in minutes and seconds, not hours. Um, no one wants their customers to find problems before they do. Uh, and we help our customers maintain that trust uh, with their customers. So for example, by leveraging PageDuty, zero uh, reduced major incidents by 50% uh, while adding major efficiencies to their incident response processes, seeing a mean time to resolution reduction of 75% uh, in just one year. Wow, that's impressive. Okay, so we're kind of touching on the idea of digital acceleration here. So why should organizations put this on their agenda? Um, due to the pandemic, uh, we have all fundamentally shifted to a digital default world, seemingly overnight, uh, from the way we work, uh, live, work out uh, and learn everything is online uh, and this requires businesses to rapidly shift their operating models to a digital default uh, as well. Um, in fact, with a distributed and decentralized workforce, organizations are realizing the need to prioritize digital acceleration to ensure reliability and availability on the most critical consumer facing applications. Although, Many institutions had already initiated these programs in, in terms of migrating critical in-house applications to secure multi-cloud environments. They're having to do it a lot quicker now. And it makes sense from a cost optimization and market value creation standpoint as well, right? It's important uh, that companies adopt full service ownership and modern operational best practices uh, like DevOps. Pager actually did a recent uh, survey with IT teams in Australia and New Zealand, where it showed a significant uh, increase in pressure on digital services. Uh, they have, the teams have seen a 79% increase in alerts and incidents. Orchestrating teams is harder uh, when people are working from home. Um, in fact, our solutions consulting team uh, has been working with top ASX companies to assess their current incident response processes and provide recommendations on best practices uh, that are helping an increased employee productivity uh, and reduced downtime. So uh, innovation, uh, as these changes happen, innovation is really shifting to serve people, uh, not systems. This is not a time for uh, businesses to simply survive. It's time to really thrive. Uh, it's time for digital operations. And uh, in, in great news for Australia, even the government also recently announced an $800 million support for businesses to go digital. So that's why digital uh, acceleration is important and should be top of the agenda. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. So how can PagerDuty help a customer or an enterprise end user mature that digital operations process? That's a great question. Uh, PagerDuty can help enterprises bridge the gap between 
business expectations, and technical service delivery. Uh, incident response specifically is a team sport, uh, and time is the most valuable currency when dealing with unplanned issues. And so PagerD helps uh, customers save time in three ways. First is tooling. By integrating all their logging and monitoring, incident management, ticketing, collaboration tools with PagerD, uh, they can consolidate all the relevant information that may be impacting their technical and business services uh, and leverage the intelligence within our platform to get high signal to noise ratios. So for example, uh, Telstra, uh, by utilizing our event intelligence capabilities, they reduced the number of actionable events for the cloud teams from 200,000 per month to 4,000 per month. These are tremendous gains. Step two is people. Uh, people can easily manage their on-call rosters and escalation uh, pathways quite easily within PageD to ensure that only the right people are being uh, notified at the right time of the right issue on the right technical services. Uh, this goes a long way uh, in dropping uh, responder burnout and fatigue. Uh, Tyro, for example, brought down their mean time to action or MTTA by 50% uh, in the last six months while reducing the number of high urgency incidents. And then the third way is processes. Uh, processes for alert triage and incident response. They can be significantly improved through automation uh, and efficiencies uh, iterative efficiencies. Uh, so those could be either dynamically executing runbooks to responder collaboration on incident bridges to relevant stakeholder updates or to managing post-incident analysis. Uh, PG can help with the entire life cycle uh, of that unplanned issue. And once you've dealt with the issue, PG also provides analytics uh, in, in 101 different data points around team and service performance that IT managers and executives can leverage for key operational insights like responder burnout, like cost of downtime, et cetera. So car sales, for example, drove better work-life balance with a much more improved sleep quality for their responders uh, and also drove uh, a culture of accountability uh, within the organization. All of this is uh, enabled for customers uh, and this allows them to reduce service outages and disruptions, thereby increasing their revenue, reducing operational costs, uh, retaining great technical talent and improving their brand. Brilliant, okay. So let's look at PagerDuty itself. You've been very busy in the last few months. Uh, what are your most recent company and product announcements? It's, it's an incredibly exciting time to be uh, at PagerDuty. Uh, we just concluded our 2020 Global Summit series with the final virtual conference in, in Sydney this week, where we announced 28 uh, new capabilities in AI ops, incident response automation, and service dependency insights. Um, there were also major uh, integration updates uh, with uh, Zoom, Slack, and Microsoft Teams. Uh, customers can now, for example, quickly initiate uh, incident meetings from within the PageD platform with just one click uh, for any of these collaboration tools. Um, we also announced uh, version seven uh, of our ServiceNow integration that further enables service management teams uh, in the enterprises to further drive a real-time incident response uh, through ServiceNow. And another significant announcement uh, is that PagerD has acquired uh, technology company Rundeck, uh, who is a leading provider of DevOps automation for enterprises. Uh, the acquisition really strengthens um, PagerD's leading incident response offering with uh, machine automation and specifically in, in auto remediation and uh, self-healing. Uh, super, super excited about that. Yeah, absolutely. 
Okay, so how can IT executives and practitioners reach out to PagerDuty? Yeah, we're always happy to talk to them. Uh, they can check out our website on uh, www.pagedu.com. Even start a free trial. It's, it's really easy to get started. Uh, and they can even email me uh, on abhijit at pagedu.com. Me and my team would be uh, certainly glad to chat and um, help with uh, any of these operation challenges that they're looking to solve. Brilliant. All right. Definitely reach out and get in touch if you're interested. So that concludes our Tech Day 10 Minute IT Jam with Pager Duties, Abhijit Pandial. Thank you so much for talking to us today. Thank you, Sarah. Appreciate it.